Hello everyone, my name is Sunshine Experts and welcome to my Pokemon Dark Violet version walkthrough. This is made by KS Rush, a uh, developer for one of these pretty decently based storylines in these hacks. Yeah, let's get going. I already played part of this game, as you can tell already, so I know what's going to happen part of it, but otherwise it's going to be a blind walkthrough. Now, we, I will also mention that if you're starting off from just a freshly new ROM uh, for Fire Red and you just patched it, make sure to go to your options, go to your emulator, go to your save type and then change it to Flash 128K or else something will go nuts and you won't be able to slate, uh, the save. Sorry, not slate. <laughs> Let's get started. Hello there, glad to meet you. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Oak. He will have factions that can <laughs> reverse me. For, yeah, I already screamed up. Refers to me as the Pokemon Professor. This world is inhabited far and wide by creatures called Pokemon. For some Pokemon, for some people, Pokemon are pets. Others use them for battling. As for myself, I study Pokemon as a profession. If only that was real. But first, tell me a little bit about yourself. Now tell me, are you a boy or a girl? Yes, I'm a. No. All right. So right off the bat, we see a bit of a sprite change. And we're going to use the normal name for what I always use. And there we go. Uh, yes. This is my grandson. He's been your rival since you were both babies. Um, what was his name now? And so pretty much, I'm going to be following part of the storyline uh, story here where this guy is named Blue and then someone else is going to be named something interesting. Anyways, let's go, it's blue. Yes, that's right, I remember now, his name is Blue. Your very own Pokemon legend is about to unfold, a world of dreams and adventures with Pokemon and Waze. Let's go. Alright, so here's the first thing you would see is the sprite change, like I said before. They change it to something similar to the hard gold and soul silver kind of sprites. Pretty interesting. Right off the bat, if you look into your ID or card, you will notice your sprites also change and your ID is like randomized, even though know, the buzz is like that. Yeah. Alright, so go to your PC, and normally you would see potions, but instead you'll get orange berries in this game. Pretty interesting. Now, this is not like Pokemon Fire Red Omega, where it's ridiculously hard for people that's just beginning their Pokemon kind of things, like experiencing it for the first time. This is pretty much a new storyline that they implemented, so let's get this. You need to get ready. Professor Oak said that he's going to be giving you a Pokemon before you leave for your journey. Wow, did I really just say that? I can't believe this is happening. My little experts, leaving them to travel to the Kanto region and take on the Pokemon League Challenge. I guess it's really true. All kids have to grow up someday. He says I want to see. You need to get going. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, let's go. And I see coffee. All right. Palatown. Yeah, they change it a bit here. Woot. Let's go up. Wait. And I'm starting to like a bit for some reason. Let's change something here. Uh, you get to see me change my freaking thing. Oh, of course. Uh, let's change it to four. Four. Sorry. It's supposed to be in like round three. There we go. Uh, yeah, da, da, da. here comes me. They look awfully fat for some reason. I'm running on the settings of OpenGL with the filter of H2 something, I don't remember. I see we still need to work on that little attitude, that attitude problem of yours. Blue. Anyways, wait, what's green? And there's a third uh, protagonist. Sweet. Right here, Professor. Alright, now that we have everyone here, let us begin. See those three Pokeballs on the table? Each one of them contains a Pokemon. When I was young, I was a serious Pokemon trainer. Over time, I became not only a skilled trainer, but I become, became one of the world's top Pokemon researchers. However, you're not here to listen to me babble about my achievements, but rather, you're here to start a legend of your own. 
The three Pokemons on the table above me were just recently we hatched from the Pokemon eggs. They are warmed up to you guys very easily. Each one of you may pick one. Choose. Hey, Gramps, no fair. What about me? Were you listening to a word I said? I said all three of you may pick one Pokemon. Enough of that attitude, Blue, or I may change my mind. Yeah, okay. So we have the typical three starter Pokemons for the Kanto region. A Bulbasaur, a Grass and Poison type Pokemon, a Squirtle, which is a, which is a Water type Pokemon, and finally the Charmander, a Fire type Pokemon. Let's follow the storyline and go with the Charmander for Red, or aka your protagonist or the guy that you're... Yeah, that's, let's just go. Yay, Charmander. Uh, nah. So blue will take the Squirtle, and green will be taking the Bulbasaur. Yeah. Now I have one more things. I have more. I have more things to give you three. However, there is something I need taking care of first. There is something I need from the Viridian City Pokemon Center that I ordered there. If one of you three could go retrieve that package, I would really appreciate it. Thanks. Yeah. Oops, I pressed the select button. All right. Remember the orange berries, let's uh, attach it to the Charmander. Just saying. So let's attach it, and there we go. And it's apparently female, which is a 25% chance. Interesting. What is their nature? Oh, it's a timid nature. Sweet. Timid nature raises your speed and. Yeah, raises your speed and lowers your attack. So let's go. <laughs> Slowly getting out of here. Come on. Come on. On. There we go. Hey, wait. Let's check out our Pokemon. Come on, I'll take you on. And there's new music too. And the versus screen. Yeah. Now, if you already noticed, yeah, they changed the sprites quite a bit. And they implemented a few Hardcore Soul Silver sprites and also the Platinum uh, HP bar. Typically, yeah. They change quite a bit. Now for the move sets, they are using the fourth gen move pole. Where uh, normal, like it's not where normal is a physical, ghost is physical, etc. There, there's actually physical, special, and status. So Scratch is now a physical in third generation apparently. Let's see how I died with it. Okay, that's interesting. Uh, <laughs> You don't normally see someone crit on the first hit, on the first time, on their first battle with their first Pokemon. That's interesting. Whatever though, let's keep scratching the Squirtle like I'm um, some kind of cat for no- Oh my god, it probably has an advent nature. Oh my god, that is strong. Whatever though, it is done even though it used to have Yay! 42 EXP, you will not level up from that, of course. And you did not pick your out Pokemon, blah blah blah. This is the only the beginning. Just watch, I'll train my Pokemon to the heart the hardest. I'll compete and complete the Pokemon lead challenge before either of you. And there he goes. But wait. A new mu uh they implemented a new music into this. Just what is Blue's problem? He's so noxious. Anyways, let's bow. I'm not holding back. And yeah, we're doing another bow. Interesting. So you pretty much have two rivals in this uh, ROM half instead of one, and it's not as hard as the Omega. That's a relief. Oh well. Now that's doing five. I'm doing five. I will win as long as I don't get critted. And I'm probably gonna jinx that in some way, shape, or form because I already critted and my luck is so bad. And thank God I did not. There we go. Hey, I got a crit. And this will level it up. Let's see our little stat increase. It did not do crap. That was stupid. Okay. Well, that was the greatest run. Okay, 500. So you practically have a thousand gold now. Poker dollars. Money, etc. Uh, you do realize that at this point, your Pokemon has fought two battles already, while Bulo and I only had one bow down. That means you're already the strongest out of three of us. Not that I have a problem with that. 
Now let's go get that package from Viridian City. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, first off, apparently there's a sign here, and the thing is way over there. I don't know why they changed it, but whatever. Let's go over here and get caught by our Pokemon for no reason, and there's a Rattata, of course. Now, for those uh, that have to be evolved by trades, you're probably going to be using some kind of item for that instead. So, there's... It's not impossible to involve them, it's just you gotta find the item itself, so, meh. Uh, the starters will be evolving at level 18, not 16. And that's all I know from the top of my head before I started this. So, whatever. Now, there's only two points here on this route. First, I'm gonna talk to this guy, cuz... Hi, I work at the Pokemon Mart. As part of the convenient chain selling all sorts of items, we're located inside every Pokemon Center. Please, visit us in Virgin City. I know, I'll give you some samples. Here you go. Yep. Gives us potions. How many did he give us, by the way? Let's check. He gave us 10. Yeah, that's kind of ridiculous. Now, back to the topic here. There's only two points on this route. It is a Rattata and a Pidgey. Both the max levels are 4. Minimum level is 2. And I already saw this guy. Let's just kill it. Now... When I'm going back, I'm probably going to start training like crazy, trying to get to level 10, because that's the ideal level what you should be at. If not, maybe a level 8, but that's probably it. I wouldn't recommend anything lower than 8 though. Just because you're probably going to be trying to catch a few Pokemon here and there, as for I am not. That is the weakest way I can probably think of, and I'll fall behind. As you know, I don't like doing that. And let's just go. <laughs> right now, we don't have any running boots or running shoes, so that sucks. Come on. Also, remember to change your text if you don't want to read the storyline. Of course, I have to read it regardless. But yeah, I'll remember you. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's go in and... Hey, you came from Power Town? You know Professor Oak, right? His order came in. Can, you go, uh, can I get you to take it for him? To him? Yeah, yeah this is a part so still. And now we're gonna go and heal. Hey, blah, blah, blah. I've seen you so many times and I'm not gonna forget it. Yeah. Now, how this walkthrough is gonna work is that I'm gonna get 5 Pokemon's only only five, not six. Why is that the case? I don't know. It's usually where I'm only gonna get five, and then there's this one strong Pokemon that's like a legendary. I'm gonna use it as a six member, and I'm gonna get rid of it afterwards. But I don't know. But yeah, I'm gonna be gaining five Pokemon, so a team of five, and then six just open for whatever it wants. When it comes to levels, um, for the levels, I should be around five to ten levels ahead of everyone. If not, I'll be below at least 20 to make things harder. I don't know, it happens quite a bit, but it, it, it just happens. The team will be consisted with something that I can probably use, hopefully, where I can actually do something, I don't know. But yeah. Now, here's a Pidgey, yay! Alright, so. Right now I'm just trying to level up as fast as I can. Uh, it's done. Probably, I can probably get to level 8 before I get back to Power Town. No problems. Yeah, I'm gonna get to level 8 no, no matter what. Come on. Let's go to Power Town. Come on. Yeah, I made it. So, we're supposed to deliver this package of our soul to Professor Oak. Hello. Oh, how is my old Pokemon? Well, it seems to be growing more attached to you. You must be talented as a Pokemon trainer. What's that? Alright, the package. Yay. Then the music is happy. Ah, finally, these are lava cookies. I had them imported from the Horn region. Grabs! I almost forgot. What do you call me for? Huh? Oh, alright. Before you guys leave for your journeys, I have more things to give you. However, I need all three of you guys to be here. Let's wait for Green. 
Uh, I can already tell that Gloom's gonna be late for anything and everything. Alright, now as I'm sure you already know, challenging the Pokemon League requires having attained uh, the 8 badges of Kanto. Uh, in order to obtain these badges, you would have to defeat the 8 gym leaders, thus requiring you to travel through the entire Kanto region. During your journey through Kanto, you'll end up seeing many different kinds of Pokemon. On my desk to the right is my invention, the Pokedex. The Pokedex will allow you to record every different kind of Pokemon you see. That was quick. Uh, take these with you. Yeah, I never filled one of these things at all. At, like I've not have once filled it completely. It sucks. You must catch them to obtain complete data. Blah. I have not met someone or anyone that has actually completed a freaking Pokedex. In fact, I most of us actually just battle for no reason. Oh, I just remember we're gonna find you guys later. Yeah, I've, I'm only a battler. I'm not one to complete, but I do like ca um, catching as much legendary Pokemon as I can before I send them over to a different game. Whatever. <laughs> but yeah. Hey, wait up! I got to leave town as well, but since my grandfather was kind enough to give you guys a Pokemon each, I decided I have a present for you too. Town map, sweet. Team 27, that is return, pretty good. And we got the running shoes, pretty early actually. Do you not know how to use the running shoes? They come with the, they came with the instructions. Press the B button while wearing these running shoes to run extra fast. Step on these running shoes and race into the great outdoors and indoors actually. They actually change it. Why am I leaving too? You ask. I have some important business to take care of. But I'm afraid I can't tell you just yet. I want it to be a surprise. I'll definitely be seeing you again. And there she goes. Let's start running. Yeah, and apparently my sprite glitch then starts. Yeah. Hey, Pidgey, you're gonna die for me. Come here. Die. Or not. Okay, you get a crit too, okay. That's okay, sure. <sighs> These battles, yeah. Yeah, I kind of want to be at level 9 or 10 right now. Just because I'm practically low leveled. Eee, come on, give me at least a level 9. Or 9.5, please. Level 3, okay. Let's go up here, and what the freak is this? Just think of all the possibilities. You could get rich. You guys don't fool me one bit. None of you guys are rich. Only your bosses. That's why you low level grunts never have strong Pokemon. You can keep your Pokemon if you join. Come on, dude, you're strong. Join us. Or. Or. Is that. Uh, Rhett? Whatever you got. Whatever, guys. I'm calling the police. They're messing with an ace trainer here. I can take you guys all down. Hey, you! You. Do you know what Team Market is? We're an organization that researches Pokemon and find out ways on how Pokemon can be used to benefit us financially. It's exciting and fun. You should join us. Wait, you don't want to join? <sighs> I've had enough of this. It's no use. Yeah, already there's a Team Rocket battle. And we would originally meet Team Rocket in Mid Moon, which is an one, or whatever. Yeah, they're not too hard. <sighs> Practically the ones you see in the wild are what they're coming from. Yeah. But they give you more EXP, so that's great. Yay, level 9. Now, if only gives me a level 10. Where are you gonna send? It's another relative. Yeah. It's not like I haven't seen all of these already. It sucks. Okay. Yay. Like, I was gonna win to the. I wish these crap for one, anyways. Hey, they say crap. Ha 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 ha. Guys, the trainer that ran off earlier called the police. Let's get out of here. Hey, who are you? Good job. Allow me to heal your Pokemon. My name is Count, by the way. You made a smart choice, not joining those guys. They're unbelievably weak and pathetic. When he said that Team Rocket finds out ways on how to use how they use Pokemon to benefit them financially, he didn't tell you the details behind it. 
What they really do is steal rare or strong Pokemon, then sell them for huge amounts of Pokemon. Yeah, money. Amounts of money. Yeah. Then they use the money to fund cruel experiments on, experiments on Pokemon. It's quite sickening. How do I know all this? Never mind that. Team Rocket's a team rocket must be really desperate, trying to recruit trainers that are already strong, rather than strengthening their own current members. They're just flat out pathetic. To change the subject, I noticed your Pokemon. You got it from Professor Oak, didn't you? You must be one of the three trainers from Pallet Town, taking on the Pokemon League Challenge. Let's see how strong you are. Oh, this is battle heavily. Uh, this is heavily battle, sorry. Eh, English sucks. Eh. Yeah, this sprite looks familiar, doesn't it? Yeah, it's Silver, but he's named Kevin in this game. He sounds like a Nidoran, low 6. Pretty interesting. Let's go and use Ember and kill it off as fast as we can. And I. Oh, it burns. Oh well. Ha 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 ha. I don't know why. It's Ember, yay. And I didn't destroy it still, and it got a critical hit. That's 3. In this one freaking episode, and he has an orange berry that's amazing, and then he's gonna get burned, and I'm just ranting now. Come on, die! Thank you. Uh, that's, yes, that's enough. Sweet. And my speed is going higher and higher. That's pretty good. And it learns smoke screen. Sweet. And I should probably heal. Huh, <laughs> not bad. We're getting lots of money, actually. I hate Team Rocket. I'm going to destroy them once and for all. And if anyone gets my way, I'm going to destroy them as well. And he goes off. Alright, let's go and heal because he didn't heal our Pokemon after that. Yes, yes, yes. Now it's going to be a while before I start catching Pokemon. That's the truth. I hate catching them before the first gem. It's obnoxious. Oh, well, I probably have to at some point. No, did I already get this item? Yeah, I did. I remember now. Uh, so scarf. Now, if we were to go to Route 22 and go up here, walk to this direction. Yep. Hey, you're off to the Pokemon League. Forget about that. You probably don't have any. You probably don't have any badges, do you? The guard won't let you through without them. By the way, did, you get your, did your Pokemon get any stronger? And it's an automatic battle. Yeah, this is battle level. This is really heavily battle kind of game ish. Yeah, it's a Pidgey. Hi, you are a lot stronger than the Wild, but I'm gonna destroy you uh, nevertheless. Yeah, and she's in Sun deck. Eh, sun attack is annoying, but well, whatever. Alright, there we go. Uh, 82, pretty sweet. I should be a level 11 at this point, but whatever. Let's use smoke screen. I missed it. That is not good. That's not good. That's not good. That's not good. That's not good. Why are you missing? There we go. Ah. How did I start missing it? Crazy, I don't know. Okay, let's go. What was the week on? De special defense or defense? I don't remember. Scratch. Hit miss. How are you hitting? Ah. Okay. My luck is horrible today. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Come on. Egg. Oh, no, that's a Pokeball. Uh, potion. Use. Why am I so freaking unlucky? I don't know why. Come on, scratch. Okay. So I'm gonna test nine each. Oh, I'm gonna be using all my potions. That's stupid. This should be a no uh, luck, horrible luck. Uh, I can probably, uh, yeah, mm, yeah. Oh, sweet. Finally, God. And level, no, no, level up. Eh, uh, you just lucked out. Yeah, I actually did. Oh my God. 
If you think you're going, you're on the right track to challenging the Pokemon League, think again. The nearest open gym is all the way in Peter City. You should quit dawdling and get a move on. Man, I hate you. <sighs> Alright, so let's figure out the Pokemon in this route before we move on. Let's check you out. Come on. First off, we have a Spearow. A level 3 is a flying and normal type Pokemon. Your typical, hey, I'm gonna go and go faster than you and then hit you as hard as I can, Pokemon. Yeah. Pretty decent attack, pretty decent speed. Kind of ideal of what you want. Alright, and that's pretty decent, I guess. Not really. <laughs> what is in this route as well? Come on. We have a Mankey at level 4. So, yeah. It's a fighting type Pokemon. It's pretty decent as well. I believe that's a UU tier. I don't remember. Or NU. I don't know. But, it, you can probably use it. I would use it as well if I wasn't so picky on what I'm picking right now. Yay! Here's one of the two Nidorans. A female one, to be exact. It's a poison type Pokemon, and its male is a different sprite, but it's still a poison type, and I burnt it. Meh. I'm still gonna kill it. Uh, yeah, but that's on that only counts as one Pokemon. I'm still finding one more. I'm just gonna say that right now. It's a Rattata. <laughs> yeah. I don't know why it's not appearing, but whatever. Let's go and heal, and I felt... Mm, come on. Run, 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 Alright, I'm just gonna end it off here because I'm tired. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. This ROM is made by... I forgot the stinking name already because I'm stupid. Uh, go to the link in the description below to find out who the developer is. And if you want to play, play it because right now it's pretty interesting. And... Do I have anything? So I give it a thumbs up because you want to get this known. Yeah, alright. I'll see you guys next time.